Hello, this is Haku the Bean, and I am here with a subreddit that I'm going to say a few things about first. A few things that will make it clear that I am not doing something scummy or crappy in general, and I won't allow any such comments in my comment section. 1. Trans rights are human rights. 2. I am... I'm trans. 3. If you say anything transphobic in my comments, I will not be happy. Keep your trans transphobic thoughts out of my I, I space and out of your head. Today, we are on r slash... It's a long, uh, long name. Trans... I'm already gonna love it here. Anyway, I've actually been on this subreddit for like years on my own personal account, but I'm not letting YouTube see my own Reddit account. It's like breaking red rule number one. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like on the video and comment down below and subscribe to your channel. Let's get into this. I'm gonna have so much fun. <sighs> oh my goodness, this is amazing. <laughs> I get to pick my gender in South Park, the Fractured Butthole. And even whether I'm cis or trans. Mr. Mackey, the counselor, does kind of panic and call the parents, but he's generally supportive. So are the parents. Upon exiting the school, a bunch of trans folks start a fight. They're obviously made out to be idiots, and I get the satisfaction of curve stopping them. Amazing. Oh no, the blah has squished. They're gonna get uh, the condition known as lumpy. When you say Bridget from Guilty Gear is trans in a Separate that is more or less transphobic. Looks like it anyway from what they're doing. Because they banned this user from mild fanboys for daring to say that, that, that Bridget is not a boy. And guess what? Bridget is not a boy. She literally came out. You can saw up, 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 up freaking out about it. Please and thank you. I bring a sort of not hyper feminine vibe to being a trans woman that at normal that no, cis allies don't really like. <sighs> Put on dress. Have friend help with makeup. I look just like my older sister. I look just like my older sister. Dang. Yeah, I don't want to look like someone else. I want to look like me. There are a lot of um, trans fam ones right now. Twenty fourteen. Two tickets for the John Wick, please. Twenty twenty three. Two tickets for the John Wick, please. They look so much a chap here. Oh. I don't really see many trans mask ones, probably because I myself am, am trans fam. Oh no! They left you! What a surprise! 
Please shut the fuck up. Say that to me again, and I'll kick you in the balls. <sighs> Love that. If you don't get it, trans men don't always have balls. I mean, not all men have balls to begin with, but let's keep going. My brother, home early from work, me in my sister's clothes, literally in the closet. <sighs> this is why I got my own clothes. I actually got a freaking cosplay set of um, two very popular fanboy characters. One of which I think is actually now out as non-binary. Forever ago, and that's when I actually started uh, dressing less masculine. And now saying, holy crap, I'm not a dude. It's sad because my Astolfo jacket got ruined. I spilled some soda on the inside of it and it's ruined forever. What my friends say I look like. <laughs> Cute anime girl. What I see in the mirror. Uh, I'm gonna scroll past, it hurts. <sighs> that sounds a little bit personal, and I don't want to pray into other people's business. I also want to say there's a correlation between trans people and Linux users. I don't have Linux. My computer is completely Windows. But also my computer kind of sucks and isn't and one that... And it's actually just a crappy laptop I got years ago. Anyway. Time to put on your programmer socks and tell me what distro you use. I should probably get Linux. So my OS can be trans as well. So, what's your gender? Male, female, or hardcore? I mean, honestly, being trans in general is kind of a hardcore mode in, in life, isn't it? Heck yeah! We got the uh, appeals. I actually have to take those when I'm done, done with this video. This is supposed to be trans mask envy, but somehow I relate really hard to this. I come out to my mom and she says she accepts me. My mom is like the only reason I have my hormones, but still. She doesn't use my chosen names, doesn't use A them for me, and doesn't think I'm trans. <sighs> Today, I will avoid peril. Anti trans news, me. Still loving the Amori, the uh, meme I did. Hmm. 
A Terminator approaches to take away your unused stuff. Give me your unwanted pronouns, your old clothes, and your dead name. No. Because I don't want to try and remember what a de what a they are. <sighs> it costs zero dollars to remind someone that they aren't alone in this world. I love you. Just a reminder to all my viewers. You are not alone. And any trans viewers that are having a hard time with this? There are a lot of people just like you. And I'm and I'm here for you. I know the world is scary right now. But I believe in you. Alright, let's get it continued. Let's continue. Wow, okay. <laughs> My parents. Your hair is getting so long, you're starting to look like a girl. My closet and but this is actually back when I first started growing out my hair. Weird. Except nobody ever said I looked like a girl because my hair is too curly and there's basically a mop on my head. It's very fun. This is for all trans mass people. When I say I like men and people assume that I'm a straight girl. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Trans and and mask people who uh, like men are in fact gay. Amen. Just found this, entitled, Ghost Egg Scared of Its Own Tits. So, I'm done with today. <laughs> What's going on? I'm in this photo now, like it. Honestly, even and I, when I like look down or try to lay on my side and notice that it's a little bit uncomfortable, I'm like, holy crap. I forgot I have boobs. Some guy, if you wear a dress, it will make you look like a girl. Me? Promise? Hey, what are you doing? Falling asleep. What this time? Remember your first day of first grade when you were put on the girls list and had euphoria until they corrected it? Dang it! Honestly, check her out 30 years ago. Trans mask and trans femme. The paradox. Why wasn't I born like him? Why wasn't I born like her? Task failed successfully. <sighs> Facebook is showing me old trust from when I was an egg who protested far too much. You dense mother fricker! I can't be dropping F bombs, I'll probably get. Absolutely wrecked by YouTube. I mean, I'm already halfway there just by being trans with the stuff I've been seeing and like the short speed and stuff. I do not like what I'm seeing. Anyway, 
My face went out, I was completely sure about my desire to transition, and had already laid out plans for everything, but then all of a sudden, I started talking myself again and basically undo all of the progress I've already done. Frick. Just because I'm trans doesn't mean I have bad handwriting. I mean, I do have bad handwriting, but not because I'm trans. I'm left-handed. That and also, I haven't written anything by hand in quite a few years, so... My handwriting is bound to be awful. My shampoo bottles watching me... Watching me rip chunks of my skin off because I refuse to look at my chest for long enough to remove the, the trans tape properly. Oh, dude. Uh, I don't know, this is, this is a trans mask meme, so yeah. That's not a good thing to do to yourself. I get it, but damn. That's gotta be painful. Oh, dang. I actually can't relate. Actually, personally, I did not like the blue person Avatar movies. The blue aliens, I mean. Um, the main reason was, I always said I wanted to watch Avatar as a kid. When I said that, I meant the Airbender or movie is stuff. Yeah, it was bad, but I was nine, so I didn't know. Anyway, but for some really annoying reason, they always brought me to these alien movies that I did not like. I do not like space movies. I do not like aliens. I do not like Star Wars. I never got into Star Trek. I barely enjoy Doctor Who, and even now, I'm kind of dropping it because it's related to BBC. <sighs> I think that my favorite thing to happen in art history is when a guy made a Lucifer statue that was too hot for church, so they commissioned who his brother, who made an even hotter one. The gifted and boy to burnout girl with a phrase king ink pipeline. I find it buy a cute good sweater dress off of Amazon. I wear it to camp emphasize over my dreams out of impulse. I could cough get off of it saying that I look good on top of having and I've already having been caught cute. Heck yes. <sighs> I'm a trans kid. You're. Hey. Protect trans kids. There we go. That's beautiful. Eighteen degrees Celsius before E. I don't know what that is in Fahrenheit, and uh, I don't know what that actually feels like because uh, I, I'm, I'm American. Sorry, I had to come out this way. I'm work. I'm doing my best to work past that. Eighty degrees Celsius after E. Cool. Oh wait, this is fine. Whenever I see that meme. I think of of the time in um the video by Tomska where the orb appears out of nowhere and starts changing things. Where uh, or the guy is like, "Are you okay?" Oh, I'm fine. It's this orb holding you hostage. I I love orb. <sighs> Trans girls after a long day of being literally the cutest girls in the world. Shut up, I'm not cute.
Why did I tell my old Christian friend I'm transgender? It was so awkward. They weren't rude or anything, just tons of questions, and now I feel really bad. <laughs> Me, when I'm doing a deep voice, and I sound like Milan doing a deep voice. My voice is nowhere near Milan, so sounding like her doing a mask voice is a nice surprise. Hmm. <sighs> oh my goodness, that's beautiful. MTFX, FTM, couple goals. Boy, I'm going in, in, in penis surgery, girl. Okay, I love you. Love you ooh, ooh, too, baby. If I wake up, see Doc, no OGF. Where's my boyfriend? Who do you think gave you the penis? What? <laughs> <sighs> Gender envy from normal things. Gender envy from my Terraria character. How to be valid. Step one, exist. It can't be that easy. It's that easy. <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> it always is. I also love that scene from that movie. I'm also super excited for um, the upcoming movie because uh, Protect Trans Kids is literally in the trailer. Love that. I didn't actually watch the trailer because I don't know. I just didn't feel like it. Hmm. <sighs> Being a pathetic a boy, no. Being a pathetic girl, heck yeah. Wait, being a pathetic girl? What? <laughs> Look, my trans friend ends in family. Me ready to throw hands at anyone who tries to hurt them. I'm literally both. I get the feeling I'm kind of both. <sighs> My friends that haven't come out. That I haven't come out to yet, always say that if they didn't know I me, mean, they would think I'm a girl. Little do they know. <laughs> I also like that uh, uh, cute face. This character, I see this, this character in so many memes. And like, in a lot of them, she's just a trans girl, and I and I love uh, of, of these memes. I think I might just as, as like her because she's very relatable. Heck, she's even wearing a hoodie just like me. <sighs> you buying this tampon for your girlfriend? No, he's a boyfriend. Oh, you kids and your genders. Love it. Times be changing. Thank goodness. <sighs> hmm. Me, only year out, free everything. My girlfriend, teach me everything about transitioning. Aww. 
Let's see. When you transform, transform. Wait, what? Been told all the all the you punch like a girl. <laughs> Thanks. <sighs> when you're barely confident enough to dress them at the McDonald's drive through at 3 a.m., but the cashier says, You ladies have a good night. This is where the euphoria begins. Heck yeah. <sighs> Come in, the water's fresh. I have to tell you something. I might be a little uncomfortable with swimming. Well, cause I'm trans. Friend lies. Aww. I thought coming out to my friends would go. Where's this how it turned out? Look at that. That's beautiful. What? Oh, I never played arms. I don't know the name of that character. So... I can't really say if I agree with it, with this, this take or not, and also, I can't even finish, I can't even say the meme because I don't know who this is. When you, as a trans fam, finally get a skirt, but don't feel the uncontrollable urge to go spinny. Reality is often disappointing. Very sad. <sighs> Boston trans girls searching for your name should know that you get free lifetime admission to the Isabella Sue a guard in a museum. If your name is Isabella, hang on, fact check, facts checking this. Isabella's receive free lifetime admission. Reservations required for reservations. Please contact the box office at a number that I'm not going to repeat at least 24 hours in advance. Valid ID required at visit. Oh yeah, this is true. You may proceed. New pride flag. This is for me. Representing trans people who are very tired and would like to take a nice nap. Literally me at every single moment of every single day because I am constantly EP. I'm sorry. And I always want a nice nap. Not gonna go into someone's private selfies. But I will say, I don't see any sir in her. What do people think the male fantasy is? Gold, guns, girls. What's the actual male fantasy? What the male fantasy actually is? What if someone caressed my cheek while staring lovingly into my eyes and calling me a good girl? That doesn't sound very cis to me. Sorry. Hmm. <sighs> 
Oh boy. My mom not wanted me to come out to my grandpa on my own. Being this and decided to be public about my gender. Trying to change my name at my university. Screw it, I'm changing my legal name. I should probably change my legal name. <sighs> oh wow, okay, this is gonna be amazing. I'm a bi trans femme. Calm. What if I'm actually just straight panic? Me this morning literally blushing while driving to work because I remember women exist. Calm. Okay, I think that's enough for one video. That was r slash trans. I was thinking of trying to put the Trevor Project link in my description in this video, but... I think I need permission. That and also... I don't know the link. I don't know where they are. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like on the video, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel. Goodbye!